Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Alexandra and today we are talking about probably my most favorite thing ever, which is pet decor. Yes, you heard me. The reason I'm doing this video is because I feel like there's certain things in your home that people just kind of default to. You know, that generic pet litter box, or you buy like stainless steel bowls for your pets, or you buy that like bed that just sits on the floor in your living room. But I'm here to show you that there's actually so many cute pet decor products on the market. I've rounded up a few of my favorite ones that I found and I can't wait to share them with you. So let's get started. So the first product that I found is from HomeSense. Guys, it is a pineapple that is also a cat bed. I, I can't. I think it works so well in my living room. At first I was like, oh, is this kind of kitschy and like, just like a fun thing that you wanna have for five minutes. But I've had this in my living room for about two weeks. I think it totally blends in with the decor. It's kind of a quirky piece. And Harry and Marty love it. The other day, Harry was in the pineapple. We call it pineappling. So we're like, oh, where's Marty? Oh, he's just pineappling. And Marty was like waiting for his turn to go into the pineapple. Super, super cute. I think pieces like this can be really fun and just add like a hit of quirky decor to your space. It's kind of like that conversation piece that people come into your home and they're like, what is that? It's a pineapple, but it's also a cat bed, you know? I love how it has that rattan texture going on. It's kind of boho. It's like you don't know what it is right away, but then there's a cat in it. You're like, oh, that's so cute. The second thing is actually a product I've talked about before, but I've brought it in in a different color to show you guys. It is this amazingly beautiful litter box. When I moved into my apartment, I went on the hunt for the most beautiful litter box I could find, and I found this one. It's from a company based in France. There are these like French designers, which is really cool, but it's sold in Canada. They ship to the States as well. I've linked it down below. All the products will be linked down below, but I just love how it comes in these really fun colors. I personally have the white one, and I love how it blends into my space, but this purple is so beautiful. And again, that conversation piece, when people come over, they're like, what is that? and it turns out that it's like the most beautiful litter box ever to be made. It's curved, so when the cat walks in, you don't see them doing their business. It's completely hidden, it's really dark, which cats really like, and then it has this grate at the end, so when they come out, all the litter falls into the grate and they don't like tread litter all over the house, which is amazing. And like I said, I've had this in my home for a good solid like half a year now, and it doesn't smell, which is, Amazing. Everyone needs one of these litter boxes. It's a little bit pricier, but honestly, totally worth the splurge, especially if you have two cats like I do. The next item is from Etsy. So it's handmade. Guys, I can't even explain the happiness that this product brings me. It is a tent decked out in pom-poms and flowers, which combined are like probably my most favorite things. I just, I'm obsessed with this. I think it's like hilarious, but also a beautiful piece of decor to have in your living room. My plan is that I'm gonna put this out on the patio in the summer. I think it's gonna be really cute and just such a good spot for the cats to like cool down when they're outside. Um, and it just like, it just, I'm looking at it because it's just hilarious and adorable. I set this up today. Marty was obsessed with it. Harriet was like, when can I go in? And Carl and I were joking that Marty is like living his best life in Coachella. All he needs is a little flower crown and he's like, he's there. It's essentially like a glamping tent for cats, which personally, I don't know if there's anything better in life. Leave a comment down below if you would buy this for your cat. Is it too much? Is it really cute? I love the idea of putting this in a bedroom. Oh, also I will mention that this is totally for small dogs as well. They sell different sizes, lots of colors. Check out the Etsy store below. It's absolutely adorable and everyone needs one of these. I just have this image of Marty with sunglasses on. <laughs> So I've also included a few dog beds as well. I'm a cat lover, but like I also accept that there's dog lovers out there too. So I found this really gorgeous, it's like a floor cushion. Um, it's very Moroccan inspired. It has lots of texture. It's a little bit bigger. I mean, you could totally use it for cats, but I think really it's meant for a dog. And again, I just love how this totally blends in with Hi. <laughs> Do you want to sit with me? 
sorry guys, I just had to grab Harriet because she was looking so adorable down there. What I love about this piece and kind of all of these pet furniture pieces is that they totally work in conjunction with the rest of your living room. You wouldn't know that it's a pet bed. It actually looks like one of those floor cushions that people sit on. I just tucked it under my coffee table. So again, you're not walking into someone's space and being like, oh, that's where your dog sleeps. It's just nicely tucked away and totally works seamlessly with the rest of your decor. Right? She loves it. <laughs> Kind of similar to this floor cushion, I also found a round version. Again, a little bit big for a cat, but definitely if you have a dog. I love how it's in this fun like black and white tribal print. Again, just like an, a beautiful alternative to your kind of standard dog bed. I've placed it beside my bed. I think it looks so cute tucked away in this corner. I love how they have handles so you can easily move them around your house and place them in different areas. And just looks so comfy. Like I just want to curl up on all of these floor cushions and maybe in the pom-pom tent. <laughs> so I also found this kind of hilarious cottage bed. I was like, are we in Muskoka? Canadians will know exactly what I mean by that. But again, I just wanted to bring this in to show that there are so many different styles of pet furniture to match back to the style of your home. I've put a uh, sheepskin on top of this bed just to make it a little extra cozy. But again, I love that warm wood and that it literally looks like it belongs in a cottage. Marty is currently sleeping on this bed right now. He looks like he totally fits in it. Again, I think it could be for like a medium sized dog, but it's super cute. And I just had to include it because it really reminded me of like cottaging at Muskoka in the summer. <laughs> I also wanted to talk about a product that I don't physically have here, but I'm gonna insert a photo here, somewhere on the screen. And this is a cat scratcher that I found also on Etsy. I feel like cat scratchers, again, are those things that people buy at the dollar store or at the pet store just to have, and like they do not look cute at all. But this cat scratcher is so adorable. I love the palm leaf print. I love that it's made of wood. You can replace the actual cardboard inside of it. Um, I just think, it, again, it's like a beautiful piece for your home that doesn't look like you bought it because you know, you thought that it was the only option out there. And last but not least is this absolutely beautiful cat food bowl. Again, I feel like these are things that we kind of just overlook. We grab things from the pet store, things that look, you know, half decent. This is like the most gorgeous pet bowl. And honestly, I'm just like looking at it from here and it kind of changes the whole vibe of my kitchen. It's like these small little details that end up making such a huge, huge difference. It's kind of like, what I preach all the time, but I really do believe that, you know, even when it comes to your pets, it's like investing in those pieces of furniture, I know it sounds silly, that look beautiful, will just kind of pull your whole home together and make it look even more beautiful than it already was. And there you have it guys. I really hope you enjoyed these fun pieces of pet furniture. Let me know in the comments below if you've ever bought anything like these pieces for your own pets. And if you haven't, which one in this video was your fave? Let me know and I will see you guys as always next Friday. See you next time.